Hello everyone, I'm Joanne Manning, Director of Curriculum and Learning at Ascom School in Sydney, Australia, where I have the role of overseeing the curriculum and the Dalton Plan. I am passionate about Dalton and how it allows our teachers, myself included, to engage with the young people in our care. Ascom is a non-denominational, non-selective girls' school where we value academic rigour and freedom of thought. It is our aim to ensure that all students build the capacity, knowledge and skills to become lifelong learners. We want them to be curious and excited about the knowledge they acquire and understand its relevance to them. This year we're celebrating 100 years of Dalton at Ascom. We have reflected on how Dalton provides the principles to enhance our students' intellectual and social growth, evaluating our practices as we take Dalton into the future. We have developed a teaching and learning framework that describes in detail how teachers prepare and practice within a Dalton school, including the intellectual rigour and curriculum knowledge they bring to the classroom and the best strategies for conducting engaging lessons. A description of effective modelling and explicit instruction is captured in our framework, as well as how to teach the elements of thinking skills and study skills. Dalton is underpinned by the central tenet that no two minds are alike, so we aim to provide individualised academic care for all our students. We have spent time working on differentiated assignment options to stretch and enhance the intellectual growth of our students. We now provide more assignment choices for students so they can all achieve success. Our highly able students are provided with higher order questions to ensure there is no ceiling to their learning and regular adjustments are made for those students in need of a different pace or approach. We have partnered with data experts and built our own data dashboard to capture student results to ensure our teachers are well informed about their students. We believe the relationship between students and their teacher is crucial for learning. This constructive relationship where both parties are working together provides a safe environment to make mistakes and try again. In our Dalton studies, teachers have individual conferences with students, enabling this academic relationship to grow. We have asked our teachers how they build relationships with their students. We have asked them to consider the kind of language they use when giving feedback, the praising of effort and always discussing ways forward to keep their students moving on from setbacks. We have spent time refining organisational procedures so students are prepared to learn. We want our students to be self-starters. It is their responsibility to come prepared for studies, having attempted their assignment task and prepared questions for their teacher. This organisation around their tasks makes Dalton students actively engaged in their learning as they identify what they know and where to next. This year we have refined our action guides to enhance student responsibility and independence by providing detailed instructions around thinking through problems and completing tasks. These step-by-step -step guides make learning transparent to students. We have developed a program to enhance academic buoyancy aligned to Dalton principles, harnessing our school motto with heart and soul, strength and courage. This program includes multiple events and activities to ensure our students have knowledge around managing mental and physical health, such as anxiety, sleep, time management and co-curricular activities. We aim to grow resilience in our students so they can bounce back. When individuals thrive, the group thrives and our community thrives. During COVID lockdowns, our students and teachers pivoted seamlessly to remote teaching and learning and continue to provide remote lessons for students in need. We also provide holiday lectures for our seniors via Microsoft Teams. We have built a new STEAM lab and upgraded all our learning spaces to ensure students can collaborate and work together to achieve academic success. Working together enables sharing of ideas and the much lauded collaborative skills of respectfulness, conflict management, clear communication, division of roles and celebrating skills and knowledge of others. 
the professional learning of teachers is at the forefront of a successful Dalton School. We've invested in professional learning with in-house ASCOM courses on differentiation, critical thinking and mindfulness, and Dalton in practice for new staff. We have partnered with universities to offer scholarships to graduate teachers who learn Dalton in practice and we bring university academics on site to work with existing staff on inquiry learning. Further, our Dalton committee is a group of teachers who perform action research into aspects of Dalton. Notable studies in recent years have been on assignment design and metacognition. Celebrating 100 years of Dalton makes us reflect on the adaptability of Helen Parkhurst's vision for young learners as active and engaged participants in their intellectual growth. At ASCOM we strive to provide opportunities for our students and teachers by constantly invigorating our implementation of the Dalton Plan. I welcome you to visit us soon.